Hello everyone, welcome to the Computers Network Practical Series. So we will be doing the practical RIP version 2. In the previous practical we did RIP version 1. So we are using the same topology which we used in the previous one. So this RIP version 2 is an enhancement over RIP 1. RIP 1 is uh, only applicable only for classful addressing but this RIP version 2 is applicable for classless addressing also. It also has some security features. So what we will do in this particular case, the different thing is that we will use a classless addressing concept, CIDR addressing. Okay. So uh, this would be the IP addresses we'll be using. So as you can see, we are using this particular address. Sorry. So this is a uh, ten for the we are using three routers. Okay, the same topology. So at the gigabit interface we are using this 10.10.0.1 and you can see the subnet mask has changed okay so because of which there can only be eight hosts in this particular uh, network okay and then uh, for this serial interface we have 192.168.0.1 okay then uh, for another router we have this 10.20.0.1 so these are the network addresses you can note it down okay i am also sharing uh, the PDF of every practical in the description section you can download from there also so we'll use this particular IP addresses and configure okay so let us do it on Cisco packet tracer So now we'll configure the PCs and the router. So first we go to PC0. Okay. So just click on PC0 okay. and then IP configuration. That's the IP address is 10.10. .10 uh, then 0.2. Okay. This is the IP address we have to configure. Okay. Now by default it will take the subnet mask of the class full addressing but we have to change this. So we have to type it now manually 255.255.255.248 okay. Then the default gateway okay. The default gateway is the IP address of the router that is 10.10.0.1 So this is configured Now we go to the second PC PC number 1 okay. So the IP address is 10.10.0.3 Okay, and default uh, subnet mask is 255.255.255.248 okay, and here this is again 10.10.0.1 okay, this is where to put it let's copy it okay, then uh, the third PC PC2 okay, so IP so the IP address is 0 0.4 and the subnet mask is uh, 255.255.255.248 okay. and this is of course 10.10.0.1 okay. now let us configure the router I'll just click here see in the previous practical uh, when we were doing RIP version 1 I did by using the CLI mode 
but there is one more way of uh, just configuring the IP, configuring the IP address using the this particular mode. So we can just click on this. We have to. This is this particular uh, th this particular interface. This one is uh, zero zero. So I'll just click on zero zero. You can see interface zero zero. Okay, I'll turn it on. As I turn it on, this becomes green. I can directly put the IP address here. Okay, that is ten dot ten dot zero dot one. Now, standard mask we have to put it 255.255.255.248. So, this can be done very easily instead of going into the command prompt. So, here you can see whatever command we are typing, whatever things we are typing here, they come in the command prompt automatically. Now, we go to this particular interface, the serial 010. So, you can see serial 010 is here. I'll just turn it on. It won't turn green because we have to turn this also green. Now the IP address of this particular interface is 192.168.0.1. Okay, sorry, this 192.168.0.1, and uh, the subnet mask we are setting it. Okay, so it is by default it will take this value. So we do put 255.255.255.252. So this we just change two five two, okay. That's all. Okay. So this is how we configure the router. Now we can do the same thing for all the other uh, hosts. Okay. Now, after configuring the IP address, if we try to ping this, uh, we want to this we want to ping this any of this PC on this network from this network. Let us see. So I am on this leftmost PC. I want to uh, ping the rightmost PC. I'll just type ping. Okay. The IP address ten dot three zero dot zero dot four. Okay. So as you can see, we are getting the uh, reply destination host is unreachable okay so we're getting this message now we'll actually configure this uh, routing table we can configure using the R we'll just set up the rip version 2 protocol okay so to set up the rip protocol we click here okay and then in the router 0 we type enable command then configure terminal now a router rip rip now we have to go for version 2 so we'll just type version and then 2 so we are in version 2 now 
now we have to just type the networks which are connected to this router zero okay so network sorry so network you know the network address which are related is the first is 10.10.0.0 okay the other network is 192.168.0.0 okay sorry i made a mistake network network i tried network then the network address 192.168.0.0 .0. so this is done we can exit from here so we'll do the same thing for all the other three routers other two routers sorry After setting the routing protocol, we will see if the ping works. We we'll left click on this leftmost PC. Previously, that it was not working. So ping 10.30.0.4, the rightmost PC. So here we can see, we can see we are getting the reply. Okay. We are getting the reply. Let us ping the leftmost PC from the rightmost. So command prompt and we we'll ping it. Okay. Ping 10. 10.0.2 okay. as we can see we are getting the reply so that's all how it works so that's all for this particular session thanks for watching